All right. What is up, guys? I am back with another video. Now today, um, uh, well, um, it's like one o'clock in the morning, and yesterday I caught, um, I caught six more li geckos, lizard geckos, whatever, and I put them inside of a container, and you look, they're but they're outside, and then my ones that I actually have, like babies and all the ones, are inside the house. Um, because my grandma doesn't want me bringing more lizards into the house. And I'm so glad that I was awake that, um, there's medium-sized lizards outside and there's a praying mantis. Yes, you heard me. A freaking praying mantis in that box over there. And what I'm going to do is that I'm going to kill him. Because I don't want him killing any of my geckos. I don't know what a praying mantis can do. I used to catch them at my old school. But I do not know what they can do or kill a lizard. So, um, I'm going to try to show you guys if I can uh, catch a good picture of him. You, okay, you see that? Wait, hold up. You see, um, you kind of see this, like, light color right there. You can't really see him. But you can see this, like, line right there. That's actually the praying mantis, and my lizards are somewhere in there. But I'm going to let those lizards go back out into the wild early uh, later today, maybe. But, yeah, the praying mantis is right there. If I can get a good lineup. There we go. You can see him a little bit better. See him? He's right there. Yeah, so that's a praying mantis that is right there. Um, he is like the size of my lizards, but I have five lizards in there, and I do not know um, what praying mantises can do to a lizard. Um, so, um, yeah, so this is going to be very horrible if... Um, this kills one of my lizards, or if, um, these lizards do eat, um, that praying mantis, oh, then that will even be better, so I don't have to kill the praying mantis, but, um, I might go outside, turn on the light outside, and maybe give you guys a good glimpse of him, um, if I had my regular light, I would be able to show you, but I do not know where my light is because I, oh, it's right here, never mind. Okay, I did find it, all right, so. Now you can see it much better. Hold up. Now I do not have my case on, so I kinda have to be really careful. Now you see him? That's a praying mantis, right there. See it? That's much better. That's a praying mantis. Now, um, Let's see. Uh, one of my geckos that I caught today, well, yesterday, if you can see him, you can kind of see him. Yeah, he's right there. Let me try to get a good glimpse. Yeah, there. There we go. Oh, I did see him before. Come on. Well, he's still right there. Um, I do have five geckos that are in here. There is one over there. You see him walking. Um, I do not know where anything is. Uh, you might not be able to see anything because, for right now, because I'm still paying attention to this mantis right now. I am not going to go to sleep with this mountain praying mantis in here. So, you know, I don't want him killing any of my lizards, so I'm going to be really careful. And I'm going to watch him all night. Oh, yeah, there's another one over there. Now, see, these are not the ones that are inside the house. The ones that are inside the house are... Why is that not focusing? Hold up. The ones that are inside the house are inside there. And they're uh, they're kind of uh, having a good day. 
not having a great day. I did catch a one more, which I have seven in that box in there. Not inside here with the praying mantis. But if you guys can clearly see that, that is a praying mantis. Now, um, I did hear a noise. Um, so I'm going to kind of tell you the story. Um, well, a little tiny story about this. Um, uh, I was kind of like sleeping, right? Well, I wasn't sleeping. I was still awake. I was on my phone, and I heard a loud noise inside this box. And I, and you know, I checked in that one, the one that's inside the house first. There was nothing in there, um, of course, because there's no bugs that come into here. Um, and then I looked into that one that is in there, and that's when um, I got my black light, and I tried to look in there, and that's when I clearly saw the praying mantis and then i just showed you guys with this um regular light you can clearly see that's a praying mantis now um i'm not going to keep them in there there's no way i'm going to keep them in there so um what i'm gonna have to do uh i might well i might keep them in there i'm gonna see what he does Hi, lizard. Who's this one? Um, I don't know what this one is. Oh, this one might be Ranger. I uh, well, my friends named him. Named him. This one might be Ranger. He sees that light. But yeah, you guys can clearly see that. Joey, you actually might like praying mantises. I don't know if you do actually. But that's clear. Yeah, that's clearly a praying mantis. Um, by the looks of it, that is a small praying mantis. Um, now, these praying mantises can get much larger than this, much bigger than this. They can grow to a size of um, almost like um, maybe like five inches smaller than a uh, regular size gecko. Um, but, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a really... Uh, good look of it and yeah I just um I'm oh that's uh Ellie in the background um if you guys are good at uh telling insects um if I can get a good look at him come on why can't I get a good look Let's see. Oh, let me see if I can zoom that out. Alright, um, if you guys can let me know what kind of, uh, well, I know this is a praying mantis, but, um, if you guys can let me know in the comments down below if you're really good at telling insects, um, if how old this is, um, what they eat, um, I might actually search it up, um, right after um i am done with this video but um just please let me know down in the comments down below um i just um if and then uh if you guys can look up uh um western banded geckos what they eat um I don't know if they eat a praying mantis or, well, I do know what they clearly eat, but I don't know if they'll eat a praying mantis or the praying mantis will eat them. So I'm kind of going to keep him in, the praying mantis in there for a little bit. Well, as much as I can. Um, if one of them does attack the lizard, I am going to run outside and smash the insect. Um, I'm sorry if, um... You guys are probably going to be like, oh, why are you smashing a praying mantis? You know, he's eating or something like that. I care more about my geckos than a praying mantis. See, my gecko is right over there. I have five in here, so they're really good in here. Um, uh, I kind of, like, changed the the land different than my other one, my other box. Um, but, yeah, so um, I'm kind of just going to show you guys... Um, this, um, 
So, like I said, if I do see it attack, um, if I do see this praying mantis um, attack one of the geckos that I have in here, I will run outside and just smash him. Oh, look. He kind of wants to be in the camera. This guy, a gold digger. <laughs> so, let's... Um, for this video, I'm probably not done, but let's, uh, get, um, let's see, for my, um, for all my lizards that I have, which is, um, no, there's six in here, sorry, I forget, um, there's six in here, um, for all the lizards that I have, which I have 13 lizards, um, for all those can, um, can we get 13 likes on this video for all my uh, Western Bandit geckos and my leopard geckos that I caught? So, yeah, I really want to get 13 likes for this video. I'm not, like I said, I'm not done. I don't think I'm done with this video yet. But what I'm going to do is kind of, you know, uh, keep an eye on that praying mantis to see if he'll... If he's gonna attack anything, um, hold up, let me. Hold up, let me sit you guys real, down real quick. Alright, so now I don't have to touch the, uh, light. Um, as you guys can see that, um, you know, so, um, yeah, so can I get 13 likes on this video? For all the lizards that I have. And let's just hope this does really go well. Um, I'm not done with this video. Um, I am really appreciate. I don't know what I was going to say. But I just hope this praying mantis does not attack one of these lizards. I do actually. I do not know how this praying mantis did get into there. Um... I think he might have jumped into there. I don't know. But, yeah, this is crazy. Um, like I said, um, if they're, um, if the Prime Mantis does attack the lizard, one of my lizards, I'm going to go out there and smash um, that Prime Mantis. Um, if the lizards attack the Prime Mantis, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go outside and just pit and just, you know, eyeball them and just let them fight, um, let the gecko eat the praying mantis. But if the praying mantis does get to the gecko and does start attacking the gecko, I will immediately just smash him with um, a glass bottle that I have over here or something else. Um... Um, I do not want to hurt that praying mantis, but if I have to, I will for my geckos. Um, what I'm actually going to do to, um, kind of show you, um, um, all my geckos that I have, um, I might actually go outside and turn that light on and show you all the geckos that I have in there. And the praying mantis is still in there. I've got to be careful with that. I don't want to mess with one of those. But at my old school, though, um, like I told you guys, I was at a sunset, uh, sunset Elementary. If you guys have been to that school, let me know down in the comments down below. But that was my old school. And there, was, there would, used to be a tree. And they would be full of praying mantises. No kidding. And my friends and us, we would just you know, try to catch them, hold us, and let them go, but sometimes we were scared, because some of them were really big, um, but to show you guys all the, my geckos, um, you know, my geckos are not sleeping right now, um, they are not, not, not nocturnal, um, I don't know why, but two, um, they do come out, um, outside, um, you know, and hunt. I don't know if they actually are nocturnal, sorry. Um, but they do come out at night, and that's when... Oh, I was not recording that. Oh, my God. 
the lizard just trampled right over that tra praying mantis. Praying mantis. I don't even know what to call it. But like I said, if I do see attack, it will run out there and smash that praying mantis. No kidding. I just don't want this. Oh, shoot. Oh, my lizards are kind of scared right now. They are really scared. Get a close up look. Now, um, if they do attack, um, I am sorry if I do drop the phone um, and not record it, but I'm most likely likely um, to not drop the phone and record the whole thing. But I will try the best that I can because um, I love my geckos. They are my favorite. Um, I'll tell you all the names that I have in there. Um, okay, so I'll name all, um, I'll show you guys all, well, I can't show you, but I'll tell you all of the ones that I have. I'm gonna sit in front of this. Okay, so I have one that, um, is kind of like brownish and very dotty. So we named him, um, me and my friends, we named him Dotty. Um, there's another one that we named Lottie because he kind of looks like Dotty a little bit. Um, we named another one Night Finder. Um, that's why I should name actually one of those. Um, uh, what were the other ones? We named one Joe. Um, I think we, how many names was that? Lottie, Dottie. Joe, Nightfinder, that's four. I still have one more because I didn't name one that's in there. I'm kind of just going to have to be careful. Okay, so there's the praying mantis. I'm sorry if this is kind of like a boring video, but I'm trying to get the most out of this. Now, one of my geckos is, if I can, and you guys can't see him, but you can kind of see his head. His head, um, he's right there, so, yeah, um, he's right there, he's kind of staring at the praying mantis right now. The praying mantis is not staring at him, but the lizard is staring at him, but like I said, um, if I do see a, um, attack, um, uh, if I do see one of the lizards attack the praying mantis, I will most likely to go outside, um, take off the lid that is on here you can't really see it it's a cardboard lid but i didn't pull it fully on there that's how the praying mantis praying mantis got in there um uh what was i saying that's how the praying mantis got in there so like i said if i do see the lizard attack um uh the praying mantis i will most likely to go out there pull the uh cardboard lid over and just wait because I kind of do want these guys to eat and if I do see the praying mantis attack one of the lizards I will most likely well definitely um come outside pull um and just smash him just pull his guts out you know and everything <laughs> I'm kind of brutal about uh praying mantises and geckos Geckos I will not kill or, you know, um, if they do, you know, oh, there, there's another one over there. But if a gecko does die, then I am most likely to uh, bury him. But in my hands, are you in good hands? All state. Um, no, I'm just kidding. But um, um, in my hands that, you know, I will bury him and, you know, just... Just bury him and put a tombstone. Um, but, you know, um, if this is dangerous to one of the lizards, um, I don't know, but, uh, you know, um, to keep a praying mantis in there, if it is dangerous, let me know down in the comments down below. Um, but if I don't see any action or anything, if the praying mantis does not touch the lizards, that will be awesome, and I guess I'm just going to have a uh, pet praying mantis, and 
at first, uh, well, I'm just letting you know, I'm not bringing this praying mantis into my house at all. I don't know what the praying mantis can carry or anything. Um, uh, don't know where my geckos are. Oh, I do see one. I do see two. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ooh, that's close. Look at his tail. He's right there. And, you know, if I... Oh, did you see that? I caught that on camera. Okay, this praying mantis is fierce. Good thing I have five lizards in there because they'll attack him. I do see some action, so I'm just going to leave it alone for right now. Look at that. That's crazy. I've never seen a praying mantis do that. Okay, so he's putting his wings down. I think that's a sign of uh, he's kind of calm. But if one of those lizards does touch him again, uh, he's not kidding anymore. And